Make up your mind, Jason. You want to be a father to your sons or an embarrassment to live down? What if it was your son? Would you betray your entire family and just avoid being charged with something you didn't do? <laughs> the guy you want? <laughs> First of all, I didn't throw myself off the terrace. You did. Was I close with Emily? Wait. What? Emily, my sister. Was I close with her? You know, the worst thing about having a brain injury is that you, uh, you can't remember the people you love. And I really wish I remembered my sister. But I've seen pictures of her at the quarter maze. Monica talked about her from time to time. Huh. And the way she describes her, she said that we were close. Like I cared about her. I cared about what she thought. I know you two were married at one point. Like, Emily has nothing to do with this conversation. She must have really loved you, man. The way Monica describes her, she must have a really big heart. And not that she would need to, but she would never marry you for your money. So I want to know, how did you go from the guy that Emily loved so much to the guy who's blackmailing me right now? Do you want to take my deal or not? I really hate for my kids to grow up seeing me in prison, but at least I can look them right in the eye through that plexiglass because I stayed true to myself. I didn't sell out my family and Emily. Well, should, can we shut up about Emily already? It's a memory. Maybe it's just a feeling. But I don't think she wants me to give in to the guy you are now. I think she wants me to be better than that. I think she wants me to be better than you. That's fine. We'll see. You remember this day when you're in prison? Because that's exactly where you'll end up.